the pen. Oh, the chicken pen. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Chickens. I gotta get the chickens. <laughs> Hello, chickens! Oh, oh, I just wanna be in bed. Oh. Welcome to a tutorial on how to make an automatic chicken door that opens and closes with light. This system contains three main components. The motorized door system, the light sensing module, and the dual pool dual throw relay. This light sensor module can be purchased online, the link is in the description, and it includes a light sensor. This motorized door system was purchased online as a kit. Say something about the links below. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. And the link can be found in the description below. The final component is a dual pull, dual throw relay that switches the polarity on the motor to switch the direction of the door opening and closing. The clear plastic box is to ensure that the light sensor inside can sense whether it's day or night dust doesn't collect on the components. This whole system runs off of a 12 volt DC power supply. To demonstrate this system working, we'll simulate nighttime by covering the light sensor with this box. You can see that when the light sensor gets covered, the door will automatically start closing. And when the light sensor senses light, the door will start opening. The way this system works is that the sun causes the light sensor to turn a switch on and off inside the controller system. That provides power on and off to the dual pull dual throw relay. Dual pull dual throw relays have eight pins on them. The way this has been wired will cause the motor to switch directions because the polarity will change. Connections seven and eight provide power to the relay and connections five and six provide the power necessary to turn on the motor. Five and six will either be connected to one and two or three and four, depending if the relay is powered or not. If five and six are connected to one and two, the motor lines will have positive and negative. But if five and six are connected to three and four, the positive will switch to this wire and the negative will switch to that wire, causing the motor to spin in the opposite direction. During the day, the sun will be out, and the light sensor will sense that there's light. This will cause the dual pull dual throw relay to not have any power, which will make the motor turn in the upwards direction, causing the door to open. At night, it will be dark, and the light sensor will sense that there is no light. This will cause the dual pull dual throw relay to have power and make the motor turn in the downward direction, closing the door. During the day, the system draws zero watts, but at night, since the relay is activated, it draws two watts. During the transition time, when the door is opening or closing, the motor system draws 11 watts. And that's how you make an automatic chicken door that opens and closes with light. Awesome.